Hello, my dearest WordPress lovers! In this tutorial, we will be creating a poll that will be limited and access to only certain people, so certain user roles. And we are going to create that poll with four easy steps. So stay tuned, let's start. So to start creating, the first step would be creating a poll, to set up a poll in your website. For that, you need to click on Add New. However, I have pre-made one to save your time. So we are going to make a student opinion poll. So based on this, your poll is going only to be accessible to students. So the user role must be students or you can give it uh, another name. Here uh, we have the title student opinion poll and you can see that I have also uh, uploaded a question image and here I have written the actual question and I have used the range type. So this is the slider voting. And for the step two, you need to go to the limitations tab. In the limitations tab, you can see that I've already configured it. However, let's just unclick all of this and do the steps together. So step three. Click on uh, only selected user role and here you can see that it also enables the only for logged in users option and because uh, in order to have a user role you have to be logged in as well so they are interconnected to each other and here we have the user role where you choose the user role you want. So if you create, um, if you choose the administrator, only the people who have logged in with the credentials of the administrator would be able to um, pass the poll. And here we have some other user roles. You can add user roles from your WordPress users tab right here. And uh, also you can customize a message for those who aren't included in the list. So you can customize, you don't have permissions for passing the poll. Um, and this, this is the message that they will see. So for the step four, you need to click on apply poll. After that, you need to um, copy the shortcut, paste it in the posts. So you need to click on add new and then um, you need to, all right. Click on this, find the shortcut block, paste the shortcut here, and click publish. Uh, here I have already published, let's see how my poll looks. This is it. So you see that I'm logged in as an administrator. That's why I'm able to see this poll and I'm able to vote and click vote. And here um, we have the average vote and this is it. Now let's see how the poll would look like if um, the poll was available not for administrators but for author for example. Now let's go to the limitation and change the uh, user role to the author because we are logged in from the administrator so we are going to be able to see the poll but now when we click apply poll so we save this and then we go to the page where the poll is displayed, we see that we do not have permission for passing the poll because the poll is only available for authors and user role authors and we are logged in from administrator. So this was it for our today's tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. Do not forget to leave a like and comment down below some other video ideas that you would like to see in our channel. Also, if you are not subscribed, hurry up, subscribe and hit your notification bell. See you soon. Bye!